Hello, welcome back. Last time I got three rooms done, which are all kind of big, sprawling, complicated things. So, a <laughs> couple of things I need to talk about. First one, you might notice everything looks completely different. Uh, I've been informed that this hold, uh, this level of this hold at least, is supposed to use a custom style called Jungle, which I've installed now. Oh dear, I do not like the way that force arrow looks. Yeah, I'm not so sure if I'm a fan of this style, but I'll play along for now at least. Custom styles usually aren't so much my thing, but like, if this is how it's intended to look, then, then that's that's how it's supposed to look. Uh, second thing, um, I accidentally discovered some video settings during the Drod Blind Race stream that happened. Uh, that was a lot of fun. Uh, that should let me record this slightly higher quality, so if things are a little sharper, that's why. If they're not, then I might still have my settings wrong. Uh, third thing, I've been reminded that level clear gates do not open until a room has been left. So this this would not open mid-clear of this room. So, um, my theory about leaving this uncleared, then standing here and somehow having that activated... Whoa, I can't click on that while I'm looking at the map. Uh, and making it in there is definitely wrong. So I should have just cleared this room now. I'll get to it when I come back to it, I guess. There's no reason I couldn't do it now. Sure. Let's do the first room in the hold. Oh boy, this style is all busy. Oof. I am tempted to just go right now and uninstall this because, like, these colors are kind of... Uh, kind of making it hard for my eyes to know where to focus, but... Uh, I guess I'll just deal with it for the moment. Okay, so, um... This was where Beethro started. Uh, I no longer have that option. That's apparently a broken wall. Yeah, oh boy. <laughs> yeah, I like this better when it was city. Um, can't catch up to any of those roach queens until trapdoors are dropped. Okay, so when I did this first, I started with... Let me just do that. Started with this. Still seems pretty reasonable. What's that? That's a trapdoor? Why doesn't why does it look like a completely different color than that trapdoor? Maybe it's just an illusion because of different colors surrounding it. Maybe it's lighting, I don't know. Okay. So that threat is gone. Um right. I did it a little bit quicker than last time. T time had been a problem because roaches stacked up there. I think I need to um I think it might be smart to shuffle these around so that they're not, um, so that you find a home if you can. Uh, looks like you can. I see turn order making that maybe possible over there. So then I can, uh, let's maybe not break that yet. This is fine. Uh, that's not. This is. Yeah, that's, that's great. Uh, yes, that's fine because none of those will make it over there. Oops, that's the wrong way. There we go. Uh, where am I going? I'm dropping trapdoors. Which trapdoor? Where? That's a trapdoor. Dropping it won't help me, though. That's toggled with this. Wait, I need that held? Okay, so throw has got to stand here. Bring roaches to him. Okay. So I can't just drop this trapdoor to drop this bridge because it's connected where this door is. That's fine. Still don't know what's up. Oh, right. I did look back at the um, the preview thumbnail for this hold, and there is indeed a scripted character standing right here facing toward this pressure plate. So I think some kind of scripting is going to open that door once I'm done with the level. Okay, so should be able to do this now. Roach Queens are free. Um... Um, uh, hey, look, a hidey hole. That's nice. Okay, and now I think the room's pretty much solved. That wasn't nearly as bad as it seemed at first. Oh, dear. Look at all this mess, though. That's fine. Oh, I killed the brain. That's why they're not braining to me. I see. <laughs> I was so confused. Oh, this is, uh... Uh-oh, I don't like this at all. 
I shouldn't have killed that brain. Let's just not. Brain, stay there. See, this is why I left the patch of broken wall there, so I could do this. Well, <laughs> leaving the patch of broken wall there. That's why that broken wall is there, so that I can open up the possibility of doing that. So now get rid of the brain, since there's only a few there. Much better. Okay. Come on now. Stop dying. Stop dying. There we go. I win. Door's still closed. Well, I haven't cleared the rest of the level, so that door's just gonna stay closed. Nobody's shown up here yet. That's fine. Okay. I did a room. Let's do another. Oh, right. I can't do this from here. Oh, boy. This style's gonna make parsing all this so much harder. Can I do it from here? Greetings, Delver. Efficient use of resources is a must. Let's see you do this one using as few potions as possible. Okay. Alright. I gotta do it. There's way too much going on here. Sorry, jungle style. That's that's what you looked like for a moment. And that is... No, 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 no. And that is as much of that as I'm going to see. <laughs> It's just too busy. That's better. Now I can read it. <laughs> I'm not generally a fan of custom styles, and that one was just... Ugh, yeah. <laughs> Had some cool stuff going, but is nowhere near readable enough. Alright, so back to city. So, efficient. Um, what, what do you say again? As few potions as possible. Is that a challenge, or are you just saying, like, you only have as many as you need? Uh, stepping on that pressure plate has done some stuff. Open everything. Oh. Oh. So if I just wait, every roach, except that one, ends up there, of course. Why does it take so long for all this stuff to happen? Like, what's... Is there a bunch of scripting going on that's slow or something? Keep getting these weird hiccups. Okay, so... Um, am I supposed to place a mimic and then, like, drop a bunch of trapdoors to stop roaches from going places, or... Dude, I don't know. Where could a decoy go? On pressure plates. However, they would get briared very quickly, right? So is this just a one-turn attraction? Which didn't even do anything in that position, so let's... Wow, why is this so slow? Yes, okay. So one-turn attraction. Every time I undo... Is there... I mean, there's like... No pathfinding going on. Sure, there's a brain, but... So what? So if I'm lucky, this might kill all of those, depending on turn order. Okay, I was lucky. That's cool. Can't do as well there. Yeah, these are all just... Places to do that. Okay, so that seems like a real good use of that decoy. If I place a mimic... No, I can't do what I wanted to do. So these roaches... Okay, I have an idea. My idea is that I want to... Kill these on a hot tile. Let's see if I can do this. So if I put this here, it should move you here and you here. Then if I put another one right there, perhaps it will kill both of those? It did. Good. That's what I wanted. Okay, and then I can kill all of these. So that takes care of that entire battalion. 
now. Still have two separate... Okay, that's not good. Having that there for that long means that this has happened now. Can I send a Mimic in after those? Let's see, so I think... I wonder. Hmm. So if I just placed a decoy here, he would just die, right? One roach dies, but one's not enough. I think I want to do this earlier. So do this immediately. Then do this. And then the briars will grow differently and stuff. Um, I'm going to wait a turn. Do that. That guy should die, and you'll go north, and things will be okay? You didn't go north. So briars grow after monsters move. Of course they do. So that would leave one roach in there, which I don't think a mimic could really go after. But, like, what am I supposed to do with the rest of these? I can't get those onto hot tiles. Is he? Oh, am I supposed to be using those earlier? Wait, where were those roaches initially? There? That's weird. Wait a second. Oh, hi. Look what I can do. Okay, so don't be so hasty. Face that way. A decoy here can kill that roach. Okay, looks like I know what I'm doing. So as quick as I can, I'm going to place one decoy here. Uh, I don't want to wait a turn. No, wait, not there. Uh, that decoy goes here. I don't want to wait a turn. I'll put one here right away. I do wait a turn. And then put one here. Hang on, but I still have this annoyance going on. Perhaps I can counteract... Okay, so... Um, Alright, let's see. So I placed this decoy here. Perhaps I can counteract its influence by putting one over here and attracting those things' attention for a bit. That even killed some. Okay, cool. Uh, problem. I know how to fix the problem. Um, oh boy, do I? Maybe. Okay, so hang on. So the problem is that roach didn't end up in that space. That's where I wanted it to kill it with a decoy. I need a decoy in... That's that's fine, I think. Um, you go here. You go here. Yeah. That's okay. I can put it in that space instead. Is this efficient use of my resources? I'm not sure yet. Hold on. This mimic is going to have to drop all these trap doors. Okay. That's probably fine. I was kind of planning on having him kill all the roaches, too. Now, wait a second. This is, like, way more complicated than I thought, because... Okay, so I need a place to start the Mimic. I guess I can do it there. But... No, this is... F fine if I do that at a certain... Oh, boy. <sighs> hmm. I think I have a problem in not having killed these roaches, don't I? Brain wants me to do it efficiently. Um... Let me just checkpoint and sort of see what happens here. Like, what if... Oh, here, look at this. There we go. Okay. So that's all the decoys I needed to use there. Yeah, using those briars shouldn't be any problem. Okay, so, Mimic. Mimic. Mimic starts somewhere around here. I can move the platform. Do I want to... Okay, so the Mimic could potentially take the platform there. I don't have to start it here. 
except I kind of do, because any other place would just be a pressure plate with a briar. And you would die pretty quick. I mean, I could put it there and make it here before you die. Let's see if I start here. As long as I do this, I should be okay. Hmm. So, possible problem. Possible problem is that I can't really scoot a mimic along on... Um, stuff. Um, on hot tiles, the same way I can on stable ground. Um, I need some leverage. There's some. Okay. And I need another kind of leverage. And I don't have it, do I? Well, I can do this. So now it's just mimic on trapdoor, huh? I mean, that's okay, I guess. Should I be doing something smart with this platform? Probably. Though what that is, I don't really know. Oh boy. Uh, let's just park it here for now. Sounds good. All right, so um, here's a spot. I need to be able to step farther north before I do that. Okay, so that's fine. Kind of. It's it's kind of not though. I need ah. Okay, so you're south. Now I can push you this way. Now I can push you this way. Oh boy, mimic leverage puzzle. It's been a while since I've had to fiddle with one of these. So, um, trapdoors. That's fine. I can do this. Uh, have to exit there. Don't have to exit here, okay? So that's what I'll do. Before I do that, let me go over here, I guess. That didn't help me. Uh, hmm. So, what, I need to pre-position myself a little north? But that's no good, because then that happens. So, I can do this then, I guess? I'm confused about what just took, took place. But okay! <laughs> I guess I'll take it. Uh, this won't work. I have an impossibility. Maybe I don't? No, I'm pretty sure I do. There's no platform to help me here. Um, so problem is, when I drop this, if I go here, then I have to continue this way. If I, Oh, I see. I entered... Wait, hang on. Did I have the option of... Oh boy, so what? I entered from the wrong angle here? Is that what you're telling me? Probably. Okay, trapdoor. Let's logic out some trapdoor puzzles. Ugh. This is not something I enjoy doing, by the way. Ugh. <laughs> uh just always so fiddly. Okay, so, um... Can I go somewhere with this mimic, please? Just let me, let me go somewhere. Fine, just drop that, I guess? That's fine, that shouldn't be harmful. Okay, so I'm trying to get the mimic to a place up, up here. So if I enter from there, I think things will go a little better. Why this super awkward little space for B-Throw? I wonder. Alright, so the way this is going to have to work, the only way it could possibly work is like that doesn't work. Why is it doing so slow here? What's the brain trying to do? Why is there a roach alive? How did this happen? I mean, I guess the mimic will kill it when he comes around there, so that's fine. 
Okay, there we go. That's how that works. Oof. Okay. <laughs> uh, all right. So, get get in there somehow. Get in there somehow. How will I get in there? I don't know. Maybe like this? What, so I have to drink these decoy potions or something? No, there we go. I did it. Okay, there's probably a reason that I haven't seen these puzzles pop up very much, because they're kind of just an exercise in awkwardness most of the time. Alright, so I'm somewhere. Kind of. You need to make it somewhere else. Oh, not like that. I wish Undo didn't take so long in this room. That's... Well... Can I make something work here somehow? I guess... I guess I can do this. I don't need these decoy potions. Just go away. You're in my way. I don't care about your challenge, silly brain. Just... I need the space. But see, I just don't have this. Oh, I can get the space. Okay. Oops. There we go. I dropped all those trapdoors. <laughs> ah! <laughs> that shouldn't have had to be so much work. Okay, so... Let's go someplace else. Kill this roach. Should not be a problem. I probably do want to go in there and do this. That seems sensible so far. Uh, well, no, it doesn't anymore with the direction that's facing. Maybe it's okay to do this. Because that doesn't cut anything off here. I can still access that entire thing. Okay, so hang on. So I'd come in here, do that, do that, and this part's fine, in theory. But then I did this. Can I avoid that? Did I have the option to step there? I did. Okay, good. Still feels fine. Okay. See, now I'm going to have to do this again somehow, but... Okay. Wasn't there a room in Complex Complex about mimics on hot tiles that gave me a similar sensation to this? Now what? Do I need to use this for safety? Oh, man. Do I need to use a decoy sword at some point? Should I have brought the platform over? Can I just not make it up this hallway? I think I just can't make it up that hallway. So, how did I ever do this then? Alright, so I'm up here. I can do that kind of pattern to get some kind of leverage and then do it again. But I have to make it, like, all the way up here. How will that happen? Was I... Did I have to do this trapdoor puzzle in a different order? Are you serious? I hope not. Okay, just let me get where I need to get. Please. Okay, I'm somewhere, I think. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. <laughs> this is rather different from the experience I had last time I played this hold. <laughs> okay, I'm somewhere, I think. This feels very old school drawed and not really in a good way. Okay. 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 Calm down, Alex. You can deal with it. 
Just, just do it. There we go. I'm someplace. Will this work? Maybe. I don't see why not currently. It seems fine. I might be done. Looks good. It could be the Mimic who kills the brain, but why? I have plenty of decoys to do it. Alright. Yes, I could have been more efficient with my resources, but why? Also, I see this. Doesn't really go anywhere. But it exists. In case I wanted uh, some Mimic leverage or something? I don't know. That felt weird. I'm not sure about that entire experience I just had there. Uh, there's a way to go here. There's a platform there. I can't bring the platform anywhere. I can't get to be thrown in there. I don't think that's actually... Oh, that's a way to go when that's open. Got it. Right. Hold on. What were you on? I didn't even notice you were on a pressure plate. Oh, that locked me in. I see. Okay. Didn't realize. Hadn't noticed because I was too focused on everything else. Okay. This may be a mistake, but let's go play with some water skippers. Guess I can't. Okay, let's not play with some water skippers. Okay, I see. So enter there. Let me look around a bit first. This doesn't look too complicated, but what's... Hmm. It's a bunch of rock giants and stuff. This looks like an end of the road. <coughs> so this would be... No, that's not an end. That keeps going in there. Alright, so... Wait, but I can't... Oh, I see. Go to the south end, restart so that I can actually kill the brain. Okay. Shouldn't be a problem. Should be fairly trivial. Oh boy, brained rock giants. Those do some weird things. Oh, Grayskin, we've got problem here. And what makes you think I'm the man to help you out? You's gotta help. You wants to earn good points with karma, yes? We nuts want to harm yous. But them um, fire gazers? They says they gonna kill us all. Starts with goblins and moves on to grayskins. Hmm. Well, I guess it can't hurt to help out where, where I can. Just know that if you double cross me, I'm pretty good with this here sword. You helps us, we helps you. Yous need helps to leave this place. Okay, okay, just let me find my way around to you. Alright, so he's probably the one who's gonna press this pressure plate then. Alright, so there's dialogue and stuff. Right. Okay, uh, find my way around to you. So that's why I would come down here. Other than just to make this puzzle possible. Okay, do I need... I do need your help to kill at the very least this nest might be able to make some of the others easier but i think i'll mostly just concern myself with well since i can do that didn't help me at all why did i even bother also i wasn't really prepared to read a goblin there uh hopefully my impromptu goblin voice wasn't too terrible uh you are all very much in my way Okay, so top priority here pretty much is to, um... Oh, hey, look what I can do. That's convenient. So that should be enough to get to that nest. Problem is, I'm dead. So what if I... Spend a little bit of time and stab this guy first. Just keep him out of my hair. Whoa. Oh boy. Um, that's fine. Hmm. 
This should work, I think. And that was the only one that was definitely a problem. There's probably some more subtle traps with the other skippers, I would guess. I should stab that nest while I'm there, since I have a decent opportunity, I think. Yeah, you can't reach me. Cool. I'm going to try and leave that giant alive for now. Alright, so what's going to be hard about getting to this nest? Uh, I made it so only one nest released skippers, but I had to give up my opportunity to do anything. Oh boy. Uh, hmm. Okay, so <laughs> can't spend that much time in the water. Let's see if I can just, like, charge in here real quick. I'd have to kill this giant. Maybe it's time to do that? Hmm, I don't like where I killed it, though. How about... I don't know, that's not much better. Alright, let's see if I maybe don't need it anymore. No, that's, that's a terrible place. I don't like that at all. Just get out of the way. And I think I can just deal with the hordes and be fine, right? Seems likely. Sure, no problem here. Okay. Man, these rooms are widely varying in complexity. <laughs> that one was really simple. <laughs> Just a couple of little traps to wa watch out for. Then this was just kind of a slog. Okay, cool. Uh, did I do three rooms? I did do three rooms. All right, so apparently that's the pace I'm going at. <laughs> that's fine. This is cool. These are very densely packed. Okay, see you next time to start on this path and um, maybe learn more about this Goblin King guy. Yeah, looks like looks like I'll have an opportunity to clear the level. I had to find my way around to him, which means through here. That's fine. This leads on to... No, it doesn't. Um, so unrequired room and secret room. Okay. Good to know. All right, cool. Well, uh, I'll do that stuff next time. I'll see you then.